So I request Nitin Gupta to speak about the role that edu vacancy can bring to the higher education table. After which, yeah. I'll, we will enter into the panel. Over to you, Mr. Nitin Gupta yeah. from edu vacancy. Uh, yeah, thanks all of you. Uh, I think all the eminent uh, panelists and all the uh, eminent audience, those who are there attending this particular session, uh, I am Nitin, uh, co-founder of EduVacancy, uh, and this is a recruitment platform which we have created for the education sector. Because what happened in the last couple of years, what we have observed is uh, every sector which is growing very fast, be it education or let's talk about uh, the startup uh, movement or other movements, you find a niche platform coming to recruit in that particular sector. Uh, and that's how uh, the dynamics of recruitment, uh, recruitment system in the country and the ecosystem is changing. So edu vacancy, what we know that like, you know, education sector is also growing very fast. And if you see in education sector, if you divide it into sub parts, you will find schools, colleges, universities, and then comes, you know, uh, the ed tech companies, uh, According to the Startup India latest news, we have got a small and big all club together, 3,500 tech companies registered in the country. And, and they're growing at a, uh, by leaps and bounds. Uh, and apart from that, the test prep companies, the companies which are offering coaching classes for entrance exams like IITs and banking and government jobs and others, they're also growing at a very fast pace. And at the same time, the vocational training institutes and the skill enhancement institutes are also growing because, you know, India really need uh, skill development uh, is, uh, you know, skilled people uh, to actually tackle the new technology and the new concepts which are coming up. And it's rightly said by so many entrepreneurs in the world now that 60 to 70 percent jobs are going to be obsolete uh, in coming five years. And we all have to see that ki, how we can enhance the skills of the students and how they can understand like, where exactly uh, they have got the position where they can work and they can perform well. So I think Keeping in mind all these things, we have created EduVacancy, which is a unique education recruitment platform where we have got video resume, which is a very unique feature because we know in teaching community and the education community, video resume can help employer to judge the candidate in a better way. And at the same time, we have got the interview inbuilt in the system itself so that we all know one more thing that at times... Uh, the decision makers are all not together while taking the interview of a candidate. So I think uh, if one or two decision makers are present in taking the interview, they can take it and later on show the dashboard to the other decision makers when they are going to be there. And they can even give marks and everything on the dashboard itself so that they can take decision easy because technology is all about, you know, uh, making things very easy out there. So that is how we are working on. And as rightly said by uh, one of the professors here, industry institute interface is very, very important when we talk about the higher education. And that is going to come when the industry people are going to be continuously interacting with the students uh, across the country. I know uh, Professor Sharma, who was from IIT. So I think uh, we all know one thing, uh, the top institutes, I'm not talking about the IITs, IIMs and XLRIs and BITs and others, but we know that the average B schools and average uh, management schools in the country and apart from that even the normal professional colleges uh, they seriously need good faculties and you know the faculties those who can add value uh, I, we understand that we need to create that kind of ecosystem also where they can put more in uh, they can they can provide more and more research papers and more interaction with the industry so what we have done in the platform is we have created a freelancer area where the people those who are working in the industry are coming there, putting their resumes and uh, giving them slots that they are available on Saturdays and Fridays uh, between this and this time. And this is what they charge for that. I think that is going to make very easy for the employers to pick the freelancers, those who are industry experts working in different industries, and they can call them in their universities and colleges, and they're definitely going to add value out there. So I think this is a very, very unique feature on EduVacancy, the freelancer concept. And we are continuously adding candidates in that particular domain also so i think uh, that is what we are doing on edu vacancy and next thing which is there is like as if now we have got uh, close to 115k employees and 15000 employers and we are catching very fast the higher education uh, domain also because there also there is a need of good faculties and uh, good uh, you know fresh phd candidates coming out of the colleges so uh, like what we have done for the b8 colleges we are definitely going to do very soon with the phd colleges the also which uh, which are offering the phd programs uh, uh, have plugged in the alumni network to the beat colleges so that we can get the fresh candidates from there and they can be there on the uh, advocacy platform 
Similarly, we are now plugging in the alumni platform with the PhD candidates in the different universities so that they can be there, the fresh candidates, and they can be there with us on the platform so that the higher education institutions can figure out them and they can always take their interviews out there and they can hire them out there. So uh, a very easy way to hire the people. And we have got mobile app, iOS and Android. So people can download that also once they register because employer and employee, both of them need to register from the uh, web platform. But after that, they can use the mobile platform, which is going to be handy to give them information how many candidates have applied and they can schedule the interview also on the platform itself. So this platform has got so many benefits and very soon, with the help of uh, industry and institutes and universities, we are coming up with the skill enhancement for the employees available on the Edu Vacancy platform. And we would really love to have your feedback also, how, what all skills you feel that key and that should be added to the candidates, especially for higher education. We can definitely work in that direction and help uh, the candidates to enhance those skills so that they are going to be better uh, uh, in those skills and, you know, can be of uh, more, uh, you know, their, their productivity is going to be much better in that case once they're going to join any institute. So that's all from my side, from Edu. Thank you. Visit.